Spruce gall midge is an unusual pest that we find on white, black hills, and occasionally Norway spruce. Feeding of the larva causes a gall to form on the new growth. The stem of the new growth begins to swell, becomes bumpy, and even looks kind of pimply in appearance. This will eventually turn brown and in most cases will kill this new shoot. The adult midge is a small mosquito-like fly that's orange to brown in, in color and about a sixteenth of an inch in size. The adult midge emerges in the spring, usually uh, mid-April to May, depending on where your farm is located in Michigan. This is usually around 70 to 100 growing degree days, base 50. Yellow sticky traps can be used to trap the adult midge, and this helps you in determining when the hatch has begun. This is important when you're trying to time a pesticide application. The yellow sticky trap should be put out into the field by the 1st of April and should be monitored every few days. Once we get into the window of emergence, they should be monitored daily. After the midges emerge, they mate and the female begins to lay eggs between the scales on the new buds. These eggs will hatch in 10 to 14 days and that's around 130 to 145 growing degree days, base 50. These larvae will then hatch and move to the new growth and eventually to the base of the needles where their feeding will cause the growth to encircle them and form an internal chamber where they'll remain and develop throughout the growing season. They'll overwinter in this gall and then in the spring pupate and emerge as an adult. And again, the process begins again. You should inspect your fields if you suspect that you have spruce gall midge. Uh, do this in either the fall or early spring. If you have just a few galls, you can clip those out and destroy those. Make sure to do that by the end of March before those adults have the chance to emerge. This works only if you have a few galls in your field. Um, what we do see is these midge tend to continue to attack the same tree and often trees are badly damaged. If that's the case, you need to remove these trees from the field. If a pesticide is needed, you need to apply the pesticide before the eggs hatch or just after they hatch in the spring. Remember, once the larvae begin to tunnel into that new growth or you start to find galls, pesticide applications are not effective.